6 News. Coverage you can count on starts now. Thanks for joining us for 6 News at 5. Flooding in a local town is believed to have been made worse by a backup in the sewer system. Something that officials in northern Cambria say has been happening for about 15 years. A big crowd is expected at tonight's meeting, which our Stoker Wysorek is preparing to attend. He joins us live where the meeting is scheduled to happen. Yeah, Stoker, what do residents say they expect to bring up? Well, Sean, I'm here by the Contrays Greer Social Hall here in northern Cambria, where residents tell me they see concerns with sewage rising following flooding earlier this month, as well as following Tropical Storm Debbie. Now, basements and dozens of homes in northern Cambria Borough had to be pumped throughout August night after multiple feet of flooding along Maple Avenue and Dogwood Street. The flooding was severe enough to where residents and their pets had to be evacuated from their homes on boats. The solicitor for the West Branch Sewer Authority, Bill Barbin, says there's been issues with those sewer lines backing up for about 15 years. Barbin says there could be multiple causes of this flooding, but says many people in the area did have sewer lines backing up during the storm. He adds they are working on rules they feel will fix some sewer issues. Multiple residents also mentioned the debris and sediment in the nearby creek. Now officials say over 30 homes were flooded and had to have water pumped out of them. The question for tonight's meeting remains as what will be done about it and who will take charge of this task? I'll have all of those details coming up tonight at 11 here on 6 News. For now, reporting live in Cambria County, Stoker by Zorik, 6 News.